Hey everybody, all of my teacher friends out there, you guys were so great to me, and uh, just a, a shout out to the McCollum Elementary School teachers, you guys gave me these beautiful gardening gloves when I retired a year ago, and I want to show you that it's been time well spent. I uh, totally dug out this little entryway here at my place and uh, put all these rocks in that I bring up from Mexico. All this stuff was dying and we kind of dug a few things up like there was lavender bushes here. That was the last survivor. It was a baby. It was way over there. So we dug that up and then we put down our a weed barrier and then a bunch of these rocks all this stuff is new anyway just coming through here the really great part of this is uh, that I wasn't really doing much gardening before just some landscaping projects and stuff so these gloves were so comfortable just didn't want to take them off so I decided to try my hand at pumpkins. Now that pumpkin is a pretty good size. This pumpkin is probably 40 pounds. The other one here is a little bigger. My neighbor grew a 300 pounder with it a few seeds a few years ago. A friend of his grew a 900 pounder with it. So this is my little pumpkin patch here. All these lily of the Nile over here I've been digging up and they kind of took off and went wild but I've been moving them all around the place here here's my pesto basil for my pesto I just trimmed it about a foot this week and made oh, a couple pints of pesto walnut pesto <coughs> tomatoes still aren't coming in these are early girl tomatoes they'll be nice they're coming got a lot of fruit up in here anyway I built this little compost pile I put the straw down it's rice straw just kind of keeps a little permaculture kind of deal where it keeps it the soil moist all the time this fig tree was back there where that structure is so I dug it up it had roots going under the sidewalk back here but I uh, <laughs> dug it up, moved it over here about a month ago, and I used all this potting soil I get. I get free potting soil over at this place. They recycle it from all the hemp farmers. So uh, you can go get, bag it up yourself. You gotta shake out some roots. But uh, anyway, all this stuff back here, we're working on a bunch of new pots back in the corner there so McCollum thank you guys I'm using your gloves I'll wear them out that's for sure and then I'll go buy another pair and you guys were awesome and I hope we we will all get through all of this terrible uh, time with all this uh, virus stuff and school closures and stuff I know you guys are still working hard though God bless you all. It's Tom Riley. I'm giving you a shout out and thanks again. Oh, wait a second. Yeah, I got some big zucchinis back here. These things grow six inches a day. These things, I just harvested a few of them. They just. Anyway, I got three of these. Good view of the tomatoes there. Bye, you guys.